Good morning, kindergarten, and welcome to today's writing lesson. You're going to need this sheet of paper from your writing folder. You're also going to need markers. You're going to need as many markers as there are letters in your name. So Silas's name, my son, he has one, two, three, four, five letters in his name. So he needs one, two, three, four, five markers. Now looking at his name, you're going to see that the letters in his name always have a one. Sometimes the, the letters have a one and a two, okay? And some letters have a one, two, and three, but it looks like Silas's name only has ones and twos. Now what that means is how many times you lift the marker up off the paper to make a different stroke. So his first letter, his S, has one stroke. That means I put the marker on the paper and I stay on the paper until that one stroke is finished. Now, the way that I hold a marker is the same way that I would hold a pencil. I use my pointer to aim. I use my thumb and my other fingers to hold. I hold the marker at the bottom, not the middle, not the top. Okay, now I'm starting at the one. This tells me where I start. And I'm going to trace. When you trace something, you basically are going over top of it. Okay, so here's my uppercase letter S. I'm going to trace right over top until the stroke is finished. Okay. Now, I capped my marker. I didn't want to lose the cap, but I need to put this one back on like that, you see? Sometimes to make sure the cap doesn't fall off, to make sure that your markers don't get wasted, you make sure the cap goes click. And I'm gonna say that all the time in kindergarten is make sure the cap goes click. And while I'm using a marker, I always put the cap on the end so it doesn't get lost. So in Silas's name, we have uppercase S, lowercase I. We start at the one, we follow the stroke. There's stroke one. Floating dot is stroke two, okay? Changing the color of my marker because I want this to be a rainbow name. When we use lots of colors in our writing, that's called rainbow writing. We're rainbow writing our names today. S. I, next letter is L. One stroke down, straight down for L. Okay. Make sure the marker goes click. You heard it click that time. Good, next color. Place my cap on the end so it doesn't get lost. Hold my marker. Stroke one. Stroke two, right around and down. That is the letter A. Okay, we have one more letter in Silas's name. Make sure the cap goes quick. Here we are, put the cap on the end of the marker when we use it. One stroke, look, his name starts with an uppercase S and it ends with a lowercase s. You see how it's smaller? Loop-de-loop -loop for an s. Loop-de-loop -loop for an s. Silas. S-I-L-A-S spells so Silas. Sometimes when you want to learn your name, you have to think of a song. The song that Silas has for his name goes S. I L A S S I L A S S I L A S is how you spell Silas. Tell me the colors that we use for Silas's name. Green, red, purple, blue, orange. Good. When you finish with that, I would like for you to try to write your name nice and neat making sure that your first letter is uppercase and large and that your other letters are lowercase. 
When you finish with this activity, I'd like for you to take a picture and upload it into Seesaw.